in the last episode we got our hands into a bit of Britannia and completed this first law bit to get andesite to alloy and that allowed us to get to this part where we're going to be playing with crates and it looks like we're also going to be a bit of immersive engineering because how do you make that in Yes, hammer should be iron and string. We've got two pieces of iron, we've got string. And we should have two sticks here. Volumes all the way up. <laughs> uh, there we go. Wait, what is my volume at? One sec. There we have it, guys. Engineer's hammer and engineer's manual. Okay, um, <laughs> anyways, so alloy kim, that needs a lot of clay, so does blast furnace, okay, and then what we need, so we need for, wait, yeah, for the crates we need andesite alloy, it's crafted like that, okay, so how crate works is unlike most mods that require power sources and that they need like actual generate or like some generator they use fe or rf redstone flux or forge energy i believe but crate uses a special one which is i believe it's called um like stress or He's a funny name, but we'll get into that just now. Because what we need is a water wheel connected to stress, that's it. So it's weird. You can make the first one, then make a second one that's way bigger. Let me just make a whole bunch there. I think I might make four. That should be good enough. And there we go. <sighs> One problem with the quest. There we go. Okay. Anyways, we need another chest to store more stuff. That's doing okay. Now that we have these, let's get into a bit more. So, if we just strip some logs and take some of this in the size anyway, we can make some inside casings. Destroy that. There we go. So, millstone grinds stuff down. I believe it can grind cobblestone into. Um, gravel which is really good then a sifter will sift it into the normal stuff then brass mesh i believe we need that to sift a whole bunch of stuff so let's see alloy kim cool um wait what's the bricks called okay so we're gonna need <laughs> that we don't need that 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 or that okay so how do we make these just brick and sandstone okay i believe we need eight of those then so let's get that going then what else would we need that's then how do we make brass brass yep we're gonna need copper and zinc copper and zinc copper and zinc so we're gonna be sifting more down and 
more on that topic. Let me just see here. How many gold pieces is that? It's six. Because there were these special little quests here that we've seen, and the one thing that I want to get is cobblestone. You see these? They generate cobblestone passively, so I don't have to do all the funny stuff. Cobblestone. So you've got tier one, which is just wood with some buckets, then tier two, then tier three, tier four, which I want to make now. Tier five is that, but what is this? What do you do? Don't know. Weird. Yeah, so that's what I want to try to get, and then I believe we're going to need some stone because for lava, which we need, we're going to have to make crucible. And I believe we have to have a so heat source on it. Oh! That's done with clay. Yeah. Okay. Take that out. Let me get the clay, whole bunch of sand, stuff for the crucible, and then let's get crafting. After a little bit of time, I've managed to get what we need. So, how the climb work, works is it's multi block structure. Most of, most of engineering is. So you build it like this, then whichever side you want facing, you take your engineering hammer and you right click. You can access it from all sides, but this is the front. Then, for brass we need brass, zinc or zinc and copper. Then you add a little bit of in. I don't think I can speed this up right. Oh no, I can. Huh. And then that gets us two. That's one thing off our list. Next is actually we need two of them. Then most stone is any piece of stone, which I believe we have one here. And it's our casing in the club. This we need another one. There we go. So we need two andesite casings from our backpack. Let's just grab the water wheels out as well. With that, we need two of those. That, that, that for the most stone, then that sticks. And that's for the sifter. We actually need a secondary sifter. I'll, I'll, um, not, let's just make another more stone as well. We'll make the process go quicker. One of these and one of those. Okay. So me bolded at this side because these are crate contraptions as you can see they need cog or they need crate power which I've shown you guys a tiny bit in the project sacrifice that's it so if we quickly just build out oh man um this engineer okay there. Why? This is very odd. No. Is that really how we lose a water wheel? So falls into the void. 
why can't I just play shoot normally? <sighs> Let me quickly fix it. Okay, finally got it going. And what we need now is if we go over here, there's quite a fun thing to do. So wait, I believe, I believe it's 4 RPM, then 8, 8, 16, 32, 64, 1, 20, yeah, then 5 of these, 2, 4, 5, okay. So there's this really cool thing. So, I mean, if you go like, where's my blocks? We are about to. There we go. Let me just make a little platform. how it spins a bit faster then with these underside casings we can click on that so the shaft doesn't come out here because then we can do that and place it down there oopsie daisy repeat there to there there to there I'm gonna do then see I can't it's gonna yep yep uh, see there we go See how fast I went spinning. <gasps> oh, that's where we're gonna have the fun. Okay. Of course, my pickaxe breaks, but anyways. Then now for this bit here, we're gonna have to do it a bit manually at the start. I need a gearbox. in the middle like that and I'm gonna need you huh because all of these need cogs I can't put a big cog in the middle right actually I think I can then if I make this a vertical gearbox wrong me like that One more. Oh. How many is one, two, three? One, two. That's gonna be the cheaper route. By going like this, one, two, three, and just And then bringing these around with that way. Okay. And I think I'm gonna have to go from this one. Might be able to get away with one more. So from there. Okay. Nice, we got it. 
<laughs> really using this to my advantage. Okay. Then I'll just run it straight into there. And these seem to be moving fast enough. And everything is moving. Okay. Now, what's nice about it is after we've got some iron, we can automate this. But these can grind down cobblestone into gravel. Then the gravel can be placed into the sifters. where there's a chance for them to give us ores and what's nice about this is these raw copper can be smelted straight into a bar it it is more efficient to bulk wash because we can do big stacks and get extra out of it but for now it's fine so as you can see there we got two pieces of iron nice then I want to see here um, item pipes which one I think it's yes pipes okay this is doable because iron we can get easy enough redstone I believe just sand perfect and sand's easy enough to just gravel. Unfortunately, we can't automate the process of sand yet because we need crashing wheels. Our favorite, yay. So yeah, I'm a... Oh, that was a... I'm just curious to see what else there is. Okay. I'm gonna do this until we get enough iron and enough sand and redstone and i'll be back guys yeah so the water wheels generate the power power goes through here powers two sifters two more stones this cobblestone generator over here is making cobblestone transporting it through a pipe to a drawer the drawer acts as a storage the storage goes to two more stones which makes gravel then they each go into their own storage area and then into here at this point in time don't think they make it's actually they're slowly making more so then they'll slowly start to back up in each one then they connect by pipes into our storage chest but i want to just see something there's this thing called a deck which It seems alright, but I, if I'm correct, it has nine, like nine or so rows, and each row can hold how much? Two fifty-six, which isn't bad, but the next one can hold a thousand. Then goes on and on to the final one, which can hold what's that? Check. Um, Two billion, I believe, in each stack, and it's gonna be a ton. So this is gonna be able to hold a lot of stuff, and I believe the dock. Okay, concrete. Because I believe that's what we need for it. We just need some sand. I'm gonna steal some gravel. Just ignore my bad counting. Let's put a bit of this stuff away that we don't need right now. Let's just get one of them should actually be enough. Okay. Then it has yeah. 
any neat one of those. Let me just put all the other chunk away. Here. And let's just do it the old fashioned way. Let me stamp this side. Because I know it's going to hop this side, fall off, and I'm going to have to remake a whole bunch. There we go. So now we've got the dock. Then it needs a barrel. So that, 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 and that. And then, there we go. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah. Wait, is that part of. Okay, so the tank's even there. Nice. It's just. It's quite a bit of stuff in here. Okay. If I pick up this chest, place that down, place that in. me mine that pipe and see if I can replace it there we go okay and this will be able to hold a lot but what would make this be a lot more efficient is if we upgraded it to the red one because then that can hold more stuff but I don't think we need that right now because that will use once we've got sand but now we've got a whole bunch of other stuff and let's see so for the set, let's start to work over. We need, I mean, let me, hmm? am I spelling it? No, oh, I'm blind. <laughs> okay, so this needs anisite alloy, wood, and stone. Okay, mechanical crafters, Crafting table, brass, that's easy enough. Electron tubes, iron plates, that's easy enough. Okay. Rose quartz just needs redstone. Then, what's. Okay. This is what we need to work to paper, water, and sand. For that. Let's see. So, we need a mechanical press, which thankfully we got this done okay. because we need a lot of iron and frankly we need a lot of zinc I have no clue what those do anyways getting distracted zinc Then oops, that plus that and that plus that gives us that. The fire can quickly just shift okay back into that. We need the copper because then we can make a whole bunch of brass. Let me just with an iron block. And it's like casing and a shaft. Yeah. Makes a mechanical press. Let me just dump that in there. Get more brass crafting. There we go. Then for a mechanical press or mixer, I guess. I believe we need five iron sheets. Just gonna do that. Get the quest. <laughs> Hi. Then 
just make a whole bunch. Okay. We're also gonna need a deployer. Deployer. Wait, no. Miscount. Okay. That should be enough for a whisk. Uh, mixer. Mix mixer. Whisk. One more. Then we need some more of these. More of those. Then. And one of those. And unfortunately, as you can see, I can't go next to it because it's the spin boy. Go spin, spin, spin. So this, let's see, spin. That can go up. So maybe I'm, I might be able to get over. So if I do one out like that, actually, you know, that's just gonna be a waste. One of those, and like that, we've got our mixer. Let's grab our deployer. Should have everything for it. Then we're gonna want another thing. Then we need a base on more andesite. Easy enough, just need more cobblestone. <laughs> See how everything backs up and it's good. Always I missed the basin okay six is kind of low amount but should be fine for now and nope some more before it runs out the ways I ran out Just a tiny bit, you know, just a tiny bit. Then we can get the base on. It might seem like I'm going really fast. It's just because I don't want to waste time. But limited time. That. Then, Pokey Boy, all the way around, like that. Okay, so we can poke stuff, smash, 
that's good then fan will do now let's see fan will do now <laughs> I don't feel like the other thing other thing other thing not fun to make okay fan spinny boy need two more pieces of iron I mean look at this already we're getting mad amounts of stuff and just saw it yeah. that should be good now Do you think it would be best to have this somewhere else? But wait. Fan sucking stuff up. It's not good there. Huh? Oh, fan wins. Fan's very. ish. Then, how do we make the soul soil? So sand. So sand. Bulk wood, good or manner boy. In place mesh. Okay. I, I think this is where we're going to end it for today. In between episodes, I think I'm going to just this platform build another one underneath and just move all of this great stuff down below because it's going to get chaotic with this <laughs> I mean look at it it's already a mess I'll try to figure out how to make it look nicer add the fan into the equation and then we can see what we, where we go from there hopefully next episode we'll at least manage to make mechanical crafters and probably get close to a crushing wheel because if we can get crushing wheel we can automate sand and that's very good for the sifters because then we believe that's all the stuff we can automate so how is there any quick automation for this lava gravel flint could do easy enough uh, yeah cobblestone there yeah cool i think that's where we're gonna end it for today guys i hope you enjoyed and please like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next episode where we'll be dealing with a lot of more machines